I was able to create this weather app within few minutes using OpenAI O1 preview model and Cursor AI code editor just within few minutes. It's very easy to get started. That's what we're going to see today. Let's get started. First, make sure you download Cursor AI editor from cursor.com website. Then you need to subscribe to get access to this O1 model. So once after you subscribe, in your cursor settings, you need to enable usage-based pricing and also you need to set how much you want to use with this O1 preview models. So I've set a limit of $4 and then click save. Now it's done. Now open the cursor AI editor. I've already explained in detail how to get started with cursor AI, which I will link that in the description below. So once after you come here, just click command shift and I or control shift I if you're a Windows user. Then you'll have the composer or a main control panel like this. Here at the bottom, make sure you've selected O1 preview model. Then now I'm going to add the instruction, create a weather web app using open weather map. The UI should look modern. That's it. Small prompt, also going to mention create required files. Now clicking submit, now it's generating. Now the files are getting generated. The code got created, but I need to create those files. So going to say that again, create these files. For the first request, I got the response in 30 seconds. Now I got those files added on the right hand side and I'm going to accept. This will automatically create all these three files. And now the only thing left is that I need to add the API key. I'm going to click escape and in the JavaScript file, I'm adding my API key. After adding the API key, I've saved it and then opening the index.html. And here is the weather app which got just created. I'm going to enter London and then search for it. So these are the information I got, but I can add more information and modify this app further. Coming back to the cursor editor, in the comment section, I'm going to say, these are the only information I received, London and the weather. Add more information and add emojis to make it interactive and then click submit. I got all the files updated. I'm going to click accept all with all the required emojis. Coming back to the weather app, I'm going to enter the location and click search. Now I got more information. This is really nice. I was able to create this in a few minutes and you can iterate over again if you want to add more information or more features. I'm really excited about this. I'm going to create more videos similar to this, so stay tuned. I hope you like this video. Do like, share and subscribe and thanks for watching.